finally, what you've all been waiting for, a sneak peek of my new Pokemon Roblox game coming out, I don't know when. Intro. What's going on guys welcome back to russo plays i'm russo and today i got a special little video for you as you can see we're in pokemon fighter is fighters ex just chilling um there's no reason we're in this game i just chose a random game because i'm gonna be talking about my new pokemon roblox game that's coming to roblox feeders near you um honestly guys i still don't have a release date i just wanted to make this video to show you some of the builds tell you guys a little bit more about the game so you guys can get hyped and excited for it because i really i just said i'm making a game i haven't really said like what's going on in the game, what it's about, what it's going to look like, who's working on the game, anything like that. Bulbasaur lost his eyeball. Um, but let me just tell you guys, it's looking dope. The builds are looking amazing. I'm going to show you guys some of the builds today, and I'm going to tell you more about it. Let's just choose Diglett for now. I don't even know what we're doing. We're just walking around as Diglett. Um, but so to start off telling you guys info on the game, I don't want to give too much away, but I will tell you guys the official name as of now, I think it is going to be the official name, is Pokemon Party. So that's the name. Um, it's sort of like, oh, a Keldeo up here. Nice. Um, so basically the, the reason we had that name is because we, we like the name. It has double P's, you know, alliteration. <laughs> um, but it kind of fits the game the best because it's not necessarily a type of Pokemon game. It's, it's like a, it's like a party of mini games with Pokemon in it. So it's, it's mini games based around Pokemon, I guess is the best way to explain it. So sort of how the Plaza works. If you guys know the Plaza game on Roblox, um, you, you click on the game on Roblox and you enter the plaza, you're in this area and you get to actually transfer or transport to different mini games. So while you're in the plaza, there's things to do in the plaza and then you can transport to different mini games. It's sort of, I burped. It sort of uses that. Is it rain? Cool. It sort of uses that same concept. So essentially in our game, you'll be trans, you'll click the game. You'll end up in the park, the Pokemon park. Um, where there's different areas to look around. There's actually going to be things to interact with. You can hang out with your friends in there. You can show off items that you actually earn from the mini games, And then from there, you can transport to the mini games, And then um, you can play the mini games and unlock stuff, earn rare items and Pokemon and trainer skins and all stuff like that. And then you can show them off in the lobby. And it, it's really, really cool in that aspect. But um, something different that we're doing that no game has really done um, well, some games have done it, but we're using 3D models for our Pokemon and trainers. So essentially, our Pokemon are going to look really, really realistic. Um, they're actually the Pokemon from the original games, um, but it mash it matches our maps so well. Because I'll show you guys the cartoonish style build in a second, but it matches our maps so, so well. And by the way, I just want to clarify, I'm playing Pokemon Fighter ZX right now. This is not the game. Um, this game is awesome, but this is not the game that I'm talking about. <laughs> um, I'm talking about the game that I'm working on. Um, by the way, it's me and two other people are the owners of the game. Chimpin TV and Ben Hanley, Manly Hanley. He doesn't have his YouTube channel really set up yet, um, but Chimpin does. And you've seen me play some video, play some games with him before. Uh, but we're the three owners of the game. And the builder, the main builder of the game is Sam at Builderboy. I think is his Twitter, at Builder underscore boy. Um, but he's awesome. He's a really, really good builder, really cool guy. And I'm going to show you guys some of the builds that he made. So I'm going to show you right now, um, starting with, okay, here's one of the buildings of the game. So check this baby out. That is the build style we're going for. Um, I think it looks so cool. I love it. It's so unique. It's so like, it has that Roblox feel, but it also kind of looks like it could not be in Roblox. Like it's like really, really professional. And I just, I love the builds he's making. I love the style we're going for. And um, it's sort of like that cartoonish plastic style and it's smooth and it it looks really, really nice and it matches our Pokemon models and our trainers very, very well. I don't have an image of the trainers I could show you just yet, but the trainers are going to literally look like they're from the Pokemon games. Like the way they look in the DS games, like the, how they have like the long leg, like it's not really going to look like a Roblox character. So in the plaza, you'll look like a Roblox character, but when you're in the mini game, you'll look like one of those trainers. So it's really, really cool. And just to clarify, um... When we start the game, we're most likely only going to have one to two mini games, but there's going to be so many updates coming to the game. Sort of like how Jailbreak is doing an update every week. We're going to try and have some updates every week, uh, starting with like new Pokemon, new skins, um, new mini games, and, and eventually we're going to roll out like a story mode. And there's a lot of plans for this game. That's why we wanted to call it Pokemon Party because it gives it a really broad um, aspect. It, like there's a lot of room to do things. 
Um, but let me go ahead and show you guys another build. So we got, boom, right here, a pole. <laughs> I don't really know exactly what this is, but it just shows you, it shows you a little bit of the fence and it shows you a little bit of the trees and the side of the building. And it just shows you that the, the build style and look at that construction pole. Like, I don't even know exactly what it's for. It looks like a giant candy cane, but it's amazing. I love it. <laughs> so Sam is killing it. Again, it's Sam at Builder Bar. I'll try to leave his Twitter in the description, but yeah, he's the main builder of the game. Um, here's one of the, here's the houses too. Yes, these are some of the houses. So check that out. That looks so sick. I love it. There's a bunch of different style. Like they're all the same cartoonish style, but um, he's going for a lot of different uh, like patterns on the houses and unique designs. So I really, really like what he's doing right here. And um, the placement has changed. This is not the placement of what it's going to look like on the on the map. Obviously, it's not completed. That's why it looks like there's some like dull space. Um, but and then that tree looks really, really cool. I love the trees. And I love the little, there's a little fountain area. There's really cool stuff that you guys are going to see. I just want to show you a little bit of it. I don't want to give away too much, but I want to get you guys hyped enough. So you're like, oh, okay, this game actually looks sweet. Or eh, I don't really like this game. Like you guys can give me your honest opinions in the comments. You can let me know some ideas. If you guys have some ideas for the game or have some ideas for the builds or have some ideas in general about anything of the game, you guys can let me know. And you can also leave a like if you guys are enjoying, because I really want to know if you guys enjoy these types of videos where I just kind of talk to you guys about stuff that I'm doing. Um, but I think I have, yeah, I have one more screenshot to show you. Bam. Look at that. It's a little firehouse. That's awesome. Obviously it's probably not going to be a firehouse, but, um, if we use it for anything, I'm not really sure what we're going to be using it for. Cause some of the buildings will be accessible. Some of them won't be like, you won't be able to enter them. Um, at least not right away. Cause some of them will, will update the interiors as we go. But look at that. I just love that. And you can see a little bit of the fence right there. Uh, it has that really cool, unique cartoonish fence. And it just looks awesome. The the terrain, the uh, the trees, the the bushes. I, I really, really love it. And his, his builds are amazing. So huge shout out to Sam again. But yeah, guys, that is what my game looks like so far. And just to clarify, I'm not, I, it's like, like I said, there's three people that are the owners of the game. So it's not my game in a sense, but it is my game. Like, I'm not going to say like, oh, it's our game every single time. So when I refer to it as my game, I'm not trying to take complete ownership. Like, we're all three, you know, participating and working on the game, you know, 30, 30, 30. Like we're completely giving our all, all of us, you know what I mean? So um, we all have our different parts to play. And then we have Sam, obviously the builder. And we have Alex Connor, who's been helping us a lot with the with the Pokemon models. And um, so, yeah, so we're, we're, we got a little team together and we are trying to get, basically all we're trying to do right now is rig the Pokemon models get them ready to be animated in Roblox because it's actually really hard to take 3D models and put them into Roblox animated and stuff like that. So we're trying to make the animations look realistic and get the Pokemon models rigged and ready to go. So that's a whole process. And then obviously the building, we only have one builder. So we're, we're still looking for more builders. If anybody, like, if, if you're really, really, you know, into it, you've been building for a while, you really want to be a part of this team. Um, I am looking to hire more builders because I want to get the process going. I want I want Sam to have some help because he's working really hard and it's it's hard to do an entire map by yourself. So we also have three maps that we're working on because like I said, those builds that I just showed you are the plaza area. That's like the little park area. So you spawn in there and then you transport to different mini games and earn items and do cool things. And then you play the mini games, you earn cool items. Um, you can use different Pokemon that you unlock and stuff like that. It's going to be really cool. Um, there's going to be a whole shop feature I forgot to talk about. There's going to be a whole shop where you can um, you can buy packs of Pokemon or trainers or uh, j just all kinds of cool stuff. So it's going to be awesome. I feel like I've given too much away already, but not really. It's just simple aspects that you can expect to see in a, in a game like this, but it's really unique and, and in the way we're doing it. And also it's going to be like our game. It's going to be like our community game. Like Russo plays cringe dab nations game. You know, it's going to be so sick. Like I'll be streaming this game, playing with you guys. Um, there will be a bunch of game passes. There'll be a bunch of unlockables. There'll be things you can buy for Robux. There'll be things you can get for free completely and unlock. There'll be a lot of medals. Uh, there's going to be a lot of cool things in the game. So I'm really excited to stream it and upload it my own game. Like that's going to be so cool playing with you guys, seeing other YouTubers play it. I can't wait for that. But yeah, like I said, if you guys are really serious about building and you really, you think you're talented, you think you can do that kind of style, let me know because we're looking for more builders. And uh, also, if you know how to use Blender really well, the, th the 3D modeling pro program, Blender, um, you guys can hit me up on Twitter and uh, we can talk about that too because I'm looking to hire somebody also to rig and animate Pokemon models for the game. 
Uh, but yeah, this is Pokemon Fighter ZX. Like I said, <laughs> this is not the game I'm uh, making, but this game is awesome. And I do need to make more videos on this game. So let me know if you want to see that. But yeah, guys, that is about it. That's all I really wanted to share with you. I hope you guys are excited. Again, here are some of the pictures. Here's the firehouse. Boom, looking amazing. And the lighting is going to be adjusted a little bit, but I love the lighting. It makes everything look so like extra cool and professional and cartoon. I just really, I really love it. Also, we've changed the color of the sidewalk. There's a lot of things that are subject to change, but this is just what the builds look like for now. So that's what I wanted to show you. And then this building looks like a little shop. It looks so sick. I love it. So that is what I got for you guys today. Oh my God, what is happening to my screen? So I hope you guys do enjoy. I hope you guys are excited for the game. Leave a like if you're excited. If this gets to a thousand likes by today, I know you guys are hyped for the game. I really am excited to share this with you guys. And um, like I said, we all have our roles to play. My main role is organizing the game, like orchestrating the whole thing, um, like making sure everybody's doing what they got to do. I'm not very good at building. I'm not very good at scripting. I'm not very good at rigging or anything like that. I'm not like I don't have those talents. So my whole thing is hiring people, getting the team together, making sure everyone's on track and seeing what they're doing. I built some of the map. I built a little bit of the maps. There's three maps so far. So when we start the game, we're most likely going to have three maps. Um, and we're going to continuously add maps as we go. We're going to continuously add different mini games. So there's going to be a lot of stuff to come to the game. But that's all I wanted to say for today, guys. If you have any more questions on the game or um, anything like that, let me know in the comments. Leave a like if you guys are hyped, like I said, and subscribe. He just killed me. <laughs> and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Turn on notifications as well to be part of all the live streams and videos. I've been Russo Plays. A Dialga, what? <laughs> I've been Russo Plays. Thanks for watching and see you later, guys.